M0FXB, welcome to my channel. So what is DMR Plus? I've not really looked at this and I've been using DMR for years. So we have the usual, you know, TGIF, which is a very large network. And we have Brandmeister, which is a very large network. And most of us use that in the UK quite a lot. But you also have another option here, which is called DMR Plus. Now, if you look at DMR Plus here, there's a reflector list. So you're connecting to reflector numbers, and it's quite a long list, as you can see. It's another option. So how do you use this system? Well, there is a dashboard for uh, DMR Plus, and in your selection on your hotspot, it, you will look for IPSC2. So let's just show you my hotspot. So this is my hotspot here and if we go to the if you look at the bottom here dmr plus ipsc2 we've actually connected to the freestyle because many different systems are using this dmr plus system so we go to configuration and you set up your hotspot in the normal way this is the simplex hotspot so you've got mmdvm simplex here and you select dmr mode scroll down my hotspot is the dv mega hotspot you put in your call sign, your DMR number here, under general configuration, the frequency of your hotspot, and location as well. And then I, this is my hat. And as you scroll down further, look at DMR configuration. This is the crucial part. Now, when you select DMR master, there's a drop down here. Click the drop down. And as you look down this drop down, you'll see there is a big section for, and it says here, DMR Plus. And it's all over the world. So Australia, you can connect to Phoenix, um, Brazil, and all sorts. But at the moment, I've decided just to connect to the Freestar system. Now, each system does have its own dashboard. And I'll show you that. But once you've selected this, then click Apply. Once it's applied, come back to your dashboard. Now, there's some configurations to do in your radio. So the Part of the um, benefits of using DMR Plus is that you, if you have private dial on your DMR radio, because many will have uh, manual group dial, but many don't have that, but, but they will have private dial, you have to create a channel in your, in your radio. So let's go to my code plug. If we look at this, this is a typical uh, DMR code plug. The first thing you need to do is go to the section where you have contacts. Now, what are contacts? Contacts are basically numbers, uh, private numbers and group call numbers. A lot of us would look at this as a talk group number here. So for example, worldwide is talk group 91 and it's a group call where we could all join that channel. Now when you're using DMR Plus, you're using private call. So if you look here, you've got private call. Now you only need really two private call channels on your radio. One is so you can disconnect, which is 4,000 here and the number is what matters the most contact the, the name is more about you being able to find it but it's the number that makes that makes the connections so in DMR plus we're going to use 4000 and we're going to select private call uh, to disconnect and but to talk to everyone we're going to use nine nine and that will also be a private call so create that in your contact list first just by clicking add here and then naming it so the next thing you've got to do is go to a channel. Now you can add, create a new zone if you want and call it, say for example, if we click on this code plug, click zone, we could click add zone. And if we wanted to, we could call that zone DMR plus. plus. And then we know that we've put our DMR plus channels in there. But at the moment I've just created it in my channel here, so I'll click that. We'll go to the bottom channel and all I've done here, there's the two channels. So look, one's I've named it 4000p for private and one is nine for private. Remember, 4000 for disconnecting, nine private for chatting. I've got the frequency in there of the hotspot that I've just showed you. And if you go over on this code plug, um, on slot wise, we're using on, on, on the Kydera system, we're using on, but you can select slot one or two slot two is very common and color code i've left that at one but the contact is important that you select the same goes for if you're using your any tone go to the contact section and you'll have a drop down menu here 
and make sure you select you know the same as what you've titled it one is private and one is 4000 disconnect and then send that to your radio so now when I'll do a separate video but when you're on your radio now you can go into contact and, and just manually dial a number Now I've manually dialed um, for 4426 and you'll hear it connect and I'll, I'll do it now then I'll make a video later of me doing it but if we find on my radio if I just select contacts go to the manual dial section just on my microphone just type uh, 4402 which is a reflector number and key the mic you're going to hear it connect and my dashboard is showing me connecting to 4402 There you are, that's showing it connected. And then all I do now is change the radio to private number nine, and it means I can just chat. So I can go M0 FXB, M0 FXB uh, for a audio check. Now to disconnect, all I would do is type, is type 4000. So that's it really. So I hope this uh, helps you understand what DMR Plus is. There is a dashboard, let's have a look at the dashboard. And here somewhere, when we key, we look for my core sign, M0FXB there. And when I key, uh, like so, you should see that. Yeah, it appears there, 4,000 in green there. So that's it. I hope this helps you. DMR Plus, understand what I'm learning. Pretty much sure I've showed you everything there. 7-3, all the best.